Hey everybody, and welcome back to Investment Honey, where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I am not a financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel, and I don't even encourage you to invest. But what I'm going to do is share with you my personal opinion and views on the projects discussed on the channel. So we are looking at UFCL. This is Ultimate Fan. So it says here, you know, being an Ultimate Fan, uh, the Ultimate Fan Club is the first blockchain project that is driven at quenching the unending thirst for supporting their favorite team and club unlimitedly and rewarding their loyalty and various ways. So they do have a fair launch that's going to be coming up. Uh, so we can see this is the UFCL fair launch. Okay. We get some badges you know, as well. So we can see uh, they've got an audit done on the audit. It did pass with no higher medium severity issues. They're not photo docs you know, as far as the team's concerned, but they do have a certificate of KYC as evidenced by the badge here. All right. So moving forward, we can see this is going to be upcoming and we can see the proof is going to start in just over three days and 21 hours. Right. So uh, according to the description, the first blockchain project is motivated by a never ending desire to support your preferred club or team you get rewarded in your favorite fan tokens just by holding UFCL. All right, so let's see here. We he, we see that uh, they're followed by Arsenal, Audited, KYC, Seifu. All those things are taking place you know, by, as we can see with the badges here, Rewards Dashboard, Staking, uh, NFT Marketplace, Betting Fantasy Game, Merchandise, Fan Swap, uh, Chili's Bridge, Fan Pad, Dow Voting, Billboard Ads, Centralized Exchange Listings, Huge Partnerships, and you know, they got CMC and CG listed. Okay, so I don't believe that there is a pre-listing on this token. Um, however, it looks like they're obviously going after CMC and CG at some point, just as most tokens would, right? Okay, we got a video here, but you guys know we don't play videos on the channel as we go through the exploration of projects. So we can see the soft cap is going to be 50, and that is also matched here and as well. Okay, and then we get a liquidity lockup time of 365 days after the pool ends. And then we also see the token metrics here. All right, so moving forward, we don't get any documentation on this project, you know, because ordinarily we transition over to the white paper, right? However, we don't get that, so we're going to head back over to the main page. We see the links up here in the navigation bar, you know, YS, Merchandise, Tokenomics Roadmap, Partners, and the apps, okay? And Reward Partners, you know, so we can see all of those indicated here. About the Ultimate Fan Club, you know, so their uh, fan tokens are a rare type of um, crypto that grant holders access to fan-related memberships. Owners of the fan token have the ability to directly influence decision-making process for changes, you know, in their favorite clubs. So they give you some more information here, you know, about being an ultimate fan and in regards, you know, to their reward dashboard. Now, looking at the rewards dashboard, it says here we designed an ultimate dashboard for our users and holders. Now they can track their account and wallet through the dashboard, monitor the tokens value, historical prices, total reward value, remaining reward value for many more functions. Users can claim, oops, sorry guys, they can claim their reward in different official fan tokens. Uh, the official swap option available for many official fan tokens like you know, PSG. And they give you, I'm not going to go through all the tickers here, but they got more coming, okay? So I do want to mention that because they do have this D app you know, button right here, more than likely, you know, requires a wallet connection. If it was me personally doing this, I'd go ahead and create a new wallet so I wouldn't you know, expose any of my assets that I cared about, you know, to a site that I was not familiar with where I'm having to go ahead and connect, you know, to it. Okay, so, and I will, let's see here, I'm going to pause the video real quick, just to engage with that. Okay, so you can see here, you know, when you uh, click on the D apps, it's going to take you to this page right here, and you can see that you have to go ahead and connect the wallet. So I just wanted to show you that, you know, um, as a result of, um, you know, talking about it, you know, here in the video. All right, so moving forward, why Ultimate Fan Club be part of the decision-making process, okay? Uh, if your team is essential and a true fan, us. Uh, True fan, as always. Okay, so this right here, they got to go ahead and do something about, you know, wordsmithing that, you know, so that doesn't make any sense right there. Uh, sacrifices are the team he loves and is willing to support in a little big way. They can. Uh, even here, I think they need to go ahead and do something, you know, with the verbiage here. Again, token uh, is a key to um, unlocking this premium feature, you know, as an exceptional and a special. Again, they really need to do something with the way they've written this up because it doesn't really track well. It doesn't, uh, it doesn't read really very well. So, but that's just my own opinion on that. But I'll leave this. I'm going to leave this section alone as we're going through this. All right, so native token, we get staking and NFT marketplace, the game dashboard. So these are just all elements, you know, of the, of the project and token. All right, so we get tokenomics here. 25% going to the fair launch, 20% going to UFCL ecosystem, 15% going to liquidity pool, 10% to marketing. All right, 20% 
5% to staking rewards, and then we five we get 5% going to development, and then 5% to the team, okay? And then we get the total supply, you know, which is going to be 100 million tokens, okay? And then we get the roadmap, you know, so we can see in phase one, number of different things going on, testnet version of utilities, pre-launch marketing, auditing KYC, the fair launch, okay, launching on Pancake, and then in phase two, you just have to hover over these and just click on them to go ahead and uh, see what they're saying. CMC and CG, okay, and you guys know how I feel about this. And if you're not pre-listed, don't state your listing. Just state that you're submitting the application because these two entities, they list you when they want to list you, okay? You don't control that. Post-launch marketing, staking dashboard live, centralized exchange listing, reward dashboard live, billboards and offline marketing, partnerships, embedding fantasy game launch. And then in phase three, we see utility swap for fan tokens, the Chili's Bridge, NFT Marketplace goes live, merchandise launch, okay, partnerships, farming, vote function, the app development. So uh, looking at the roadmap, what we don't see is we don't see any timelines. We don't know, you know, if when we get to phase three, we're still going to go ahead and be in 2022 or not. Um, we don't see anything that indicates, you know, what's already been completed and process pending ongoing, nothing like that. Uh, and then we don't see anything at the end of phase three in regards to more development coming to the token and project, you know, uh, or whether it's going to whether it's going to be like a V2 on the project or anything like that. So these this is all feedback that I leave on a lot of different roadmaps, um, having covered over a thousand, you know, um, analysis videos, you know, on the channel. You know, in the past nine months, I mean, we're really able to go ahead and talk from a position of really seeing a lot of different projects and knowing that a lot of projects don't indicate that, and they probably should. Okay, so features and, and, and partners, you know, and then we get uh, some socials here at the foot of the page. So that's basically it in regards to the um, the ultimate you know, fan token. You know, this is the UFCL, you know, token. So if you guys are interested in this project, again, keep in mind, they don't have... A documentation on it so the best way to go ahead and kind of gather uh, a, a more complete picture of the project is really just to go ahead and get into the socials and see what's going on there to go ahead and do your evaluation and assessment okay so that's going to do it for me on this one if you're not yet a subscriber please consider subscribing because again these videos are time sensitive and if you are not subscribed and don't have those notifications turned on you're not going to know when we release new content to the channel okay so thank you so much for watching and as always ladies and gentlemen you all enjoy the day